Welcome home, star family. Look out, world. Star man is back. Yeah. I think that there's a real opportunity here, Court, for you to learn directly from him. I can train you. I can show you some pretty great tricks. We're going to get you on a good career path, okay? We're going to find you a great job. Hey, that sounds terrible. <laughs> TVL Nation, I hope you're ready to laugh today because we've got actor, television host, and comedian who you love from the soup and community joining us live. Welcome back to TVL, Joel McKay. Yeah, yeah Joel. Thank you. Thank you. Joel. Thank you. Are you in a, wait, are you in a classroom? Or you're, what's that? Uh, this? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, this is, this just reminds me of all the eras of life. <laughs> and uh, focus. Today is the Mesoloic. Uh, it's Monday, so it's Mesoloic Monday, and uh, pretty excited. Uh, yes, this is technically a classroom. Uh, I have my own school. Uh, okay. it, it's a little weird. Yeah. It's a little weird. You and LeBron. I, I think. Yep. I think though, Joe, when you said I have my own school for a second, you were like, "Should I start my own school? Yeah. <laughs> I would go to that school. Let's just see. Just open enrollment. Let me know. Text me." <laughs> <laughs> I, that's great. We uh, let's start a football team. We'll be on the, We'll have like a varsity football team, just two guys. There we go. <laughs> What's your mascot? Uh, uh, we're gonna first of all, it's gonna be we're gonna be called against all odds. All right. And we yeah, will we're lose gonna be called game. the tiny hats. The tiny hats. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, all right. I, right. I, I gotta get uh, get yes. right to this, uh, Joel. You were gonna get Star Girl, but first we're gonna get to Star Girl. But first, uh, you're gonna be in our neck of the woods, Denver, Colorado, yeah. with your boy, friend of the show, and star community, Ken Jong Soon. Now we know Ken's a doctor. Let's be honest. Have you ever tried to use this to your advantage? Well, let me tell you, I've never heard of the person you're speaking of, uh, <laughs> but. Uh, as we all know, Ken was thrown out of medicine because he injured so many people. <laughs> and uh, yeah, no, uh, Ken is, um, that's what really upsets me about Ken is that uh, he's so funny and on top of everything else, he was a doctor for 12 years. I, what, I have no other skills other than, uh, you know, making tiny hat jokes. <laughs> and, uh, so he actually has helped a couple people on set, including the great Joe Russo of um, Marvel fame. He and Anthony Russo directed all the uh, huge, uh, you know, Endgame and Infinity War and all I've that. Heard of he those. diagnosed, yeah, he diagnosed um, Joe's leg pain and saved him a trip to the hospital Whoa. so that really happened oh wow okay okay all right so let's talk yeah. community because community's creator dan Harmon came out to say the community movie is not a matter of if but when yes so yep. who would you say out of the cast is most excited about this Oh boy, uh, that's a good question. I was gonna say, if uh, if not, it's gonna be when, and we have already have a timeline of 37 years, so we're very excited. Um, Let's sink our watches. I'm gonna say, uh, I'm gonna go back to Ken. Ken is really excited because he needs the money. <laughs> he needs it, he needs it. Oh man. He is, he is broke. <laughs> uh, speaking of exciting things, you're coming back as Starman for season three of Stargirl. And I mean, literally, you're going to come back from the dead. Um, I've just been hearing all these rumors online that Stargirl is just the best superhero show oh, on TV favorite. right now. I assume you agree. Can you tell us a little about it? We're get you on a good uh, I would completely agree. Uh, Breck Bassinger is a superstar, and uh, she plays Stargirl. And then you got your uh, movie star Luke Wilson and Amy Smart. And you also have the cast is super talented, created by Jeff Johns, but it is in the uh, the DC universe. And I, I, as you said, I come back from the dead. I mean, I must because I'm in the show this season. But <laughs> open. I think it's one of those things where there was a lot of superhero shows and there was a lot of noise. And this one just consistently is, uh, yeah, I think they're incredibly well told stories and you'll see and give it a chance and, uh, and catch up on the other two seasons because it's I, I it's a really good show. I know when I'm on a crappy show, I'll be happy to tell you. <laughs> tell me uh, about it. <laughs> but this one is really good, and um, it's very okay, we weird only... for me to be on a good one. Good. Joel, we only have a minute, so quickly, because you play a superhero, if you right now had any superpowers, what would you say it would be? Normally people Personally. are smoking pot when Personally. this question is asked. Okay. <laughs> no, we're, no, I'm not high. Well, <laughs> 
Wait. <laughs> uh, I, wow, that, okay, so I guess my power would be getting people to smoke pot? What did you say? <laughs> Uh, okay. no. I, I'm confused by the question. Uh, no, I, w I was thinking um, my superpower would be to start schools and two-man football teams yeah. instantly yeah. like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All um, right. The that, tiny hats. Yeah, probably the that. Okay. The tiny, hats. the tiny hats would be back. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I would go with Starman. It would be. Uh, I would take the cosmic staff, but the tiny hat football team also very powerful. Right? <laughs> Mazel tov. No one's going to that school, Joel. No. Nobody. <laughs> Thank you, Joel. How dare you? <laughs> He will beat you in the playoffs. No, nope. it's no going. So, we appreciate you, DBL Nation. Make sure you check out season three of DC Star Girl, premiering August 31st on the CW. We will be right back. Thanks, Joel. Watch it. Tiny hats. Thank you, guys. <laughs>